Hey folks, Crazy Climber 80 here again. And this time we're going to look at a game called Boot Camp, and this is also known as Combat School. This was created by Konami in 1987. And it is like track and field meets uh, uh, the Marines Boot Camp. <laughs> it's, that's pretty much what it's like, and of course Konami created track and field. But uh, it's kind of fun up until the point where the computer just screws you into the ground, and we'll get to that later. But um, I think generally this was called Boot Camp in the U.S. and Combat, combat School outside of the U.S. Both names, of course, fit. But uh, there are like eight different events that you participate in. And uh, there's an obstacle course. There's a shooting range. There's an Iron Man race. Ready, there's, a, there's another shooting range. Fire. There's arm wrestling. There's a, a third shooting range. Fire. You have to face off against Fire. your drill instructor. And then Ready. you have to save the Go. president from terrorists. <laughs> and here is the Iron Man uh, race. There are differences in the control panel for the different games. Um, Congratulations on your graduation. <laughs> Boot Camp has a trackball for a controller and uh, yeah. holy crap nice arms <laughs> they can sure chuck those hats um, but uh, combat school uses a joystick not a trackball and it's much easier I think but um, other than that both games play exactly the same and this is the part where you face the terrorists and it's insanely hard because you are a one hit kill there but uh, we'll get started I remember seeing boot camp in arcades. It's cool, but like I said, they just they just run you into the ground later on in the Ready, game. It's not fair. Go. And this is just the obstacle course. I, I had to figure out the controls at first. But uh, one button makes you run, and the other button makes you grab onto the wall and, and vault it. And you just have to wail on the run button and then just start pressing the vault button. You don't have to beat the other player. And this is the uh, computer player. You can play two-player simultaneous play. You just have to beat the uh, event in time. And I made it with plenty of time left. And you get a nice bonus for a lot of time left. And then I go to the firing range, Ready, the first fire. one. And this is really quite fire. easy. Whoops. Just keep wailing on fire. the fire button and move the joystick to the targets. Fire. If you get a whole fire. row of targets, you get a, some bonus fire. points. And see fire. on the bottom left, fire. I have to fill two rows of uh, orange uh, squares. Fire. And you have to do fire. it before the time runs out. Fire. See, I'm just Fire. about there already, and I've got more than 10 seconds Fire. left. Fire. Fire. Yeah, this, this Fire. course is easy. Fire. The later ones are not so easy, Fire. especially the third one. I can't beat Fire. it. Okay, Nick? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the first player's name is Nick, and the second player's name is Joe. And now we face the Iron Ready, Man race. Go. Now, one button will make you run. You can trip on water puddles. What kind of bullshit is that? <laughs> but just keep pressing the run button, wailing on it, and then the other button is a jump button. Eventually, you'll reach fucking puddles. God damn it, that's bullshit. <laughs> but eventually, you'll re reach a, a canoe in the water. And you want to get that because that's a little faster than trying to move through the water. Just make it to land and then get to the finish line. Yeah, much of the time you're not going to beat the computer, it seems. Yeah. <laughs> so just just get across the finish line in time is all. But notice that, <laughs> and your guy lags behind. But just notice that uh, uh, you don't always face off against the computer or a second Ready, player. Fire. And here's the second uh, uh, target range or uh, shooting range. And these targets move. Note how slow your guy is. Holy crap. 
to just try to remember the patterns of where these things come from and just wail on the shoot button. And yeah, you'll get a uh, bonus for taking out a whole group of them. And now this starts to get hard because they're all over the place and it's kind of hard to discern where they're going to come from. And I just made it. Yeah! Yeah, the third shooting range, I cannot beat. The controls are crappy in that one. Now we go to arm wrestling. And uh, in arm wrestling, you have to wail on both buttons as hard as you can. As fast as you can. If you just keep up a steady, strong pace, the computer will eventually tire a little bit. And it's just enough for me to win. Yeah, you lose any event by a considerable mar considerable margin and the game is Ready, over. Fire. This is the one fire. I can't do. The computer uh, has crappy controls. Fire. You have to tap once to fire. move your crosshairs into a direction fire. and then fire. fire. And I, I would rather fire. you have freedom of movement. Fire. Shoot any one of those drill fire. instructor insignias and... Fire you lose time. Fire. Darn. See, Fire. darn it. Go home to your mother. Yeah, screw you. Darn. I don't like that event at all. I'm, I don't like the controls. You should have freedom of movement with the, the cursor or the crosshairs, and you don't. It sucks. So that's where the game starts to kind of screw you. Well, I got the rank of rookie. You can re receive the rank of rookie, private, or corporal. Well, that that is both boot camp and combat school. They both play exactly the same. And, and uh, it, once you beat uh, that event, then you grab a smoke. Well, actually, that's uh, the second player smoking, I think. Yeah. And then you have to face off against your instructor. Good freaking luck! Well, you can jump over his head pretty easy. You, you have just a regular kick, but if you press uh, both buttons together, you can do a sort of jump kick that's kind of cool, and you do a yell. I mean, this is the best I've ever done against the drill instructor in this game. He usually kicks your butt. Yeah, screw you. And your game ends if you can't beat him. There, the game will show mercy if you yeah. get really close. That's what it look like. looks like if you beat him. I used a cheat to get there. Then you do a... Congratulations uh, on your graduation. Then you throw your hats a mile into the freaking air. Yay! Holy crap. What arm strength. <laughs> and then you go to the, uh, the event where you have to save the president from terrorists. And again, you are a one-hit kill, and this level is just about impossible. Bunch of crap. You can uh, move higher than what the high score list shows in terms of ranking. Yeah, this is this is lame. I had to show screenshots because Don't I could be not get chicken. very far. <laughs> Don't be a chicken. I could not get very far in this. How do they send a young... Uh, boot camp recruit into the fray like this. <laughs> That's insane, having to go rescue the president already. But at any rate, yeah, you have to, you cannot let them stab you, because they, uh, when they get close, they will try to stab you. And if they do, it's game over. Bunch of crapola. Ah, shit, see? That's stupid. Well, a little bit later, you go here, you have to jump over these crates, and then you shimmy across this pipe here. And these guys can throw fire bombs, and then you have to go in that door there. These guys are guarding. And then uh, you're in here, and you have to face these two boss guys, and then you rescue the president. And here's little screenshots of that happening. There's the president after you beat the guys. He doesn't even get untied, and then you go out, and there's you and the president with these cop cars. 
and uh, you get your final uh, ranking. Congratulations, thank you for playing. And then you put in your initials, and that's it. Now here's the Mercy uh, section. If you just barely miss an event, just barely miss, here's what happens. You have to do five pull-ups before the time expires. And it's really easy. Just alternate the buttons as fast as you can. Come on! And it's it's a snap, really. Hurry up! There's one more left. And that's that. Okay. We'll look at Nick. We'll look at what it's like if you uh it is. If you fail, we'll we'll see what happens. But you get to skip that event if you succeed. Hey. And if you totally let go of the buttons, you'll fall. And do it better. <laughs> hey. Whoops. <laughs> Try on. it again. And do it yeah. Better. Hey. Yeah. Come on. Go no. home to your Fail. mother. I love that. Go home to your Darn mother. But those later levels are just unfair. It's like Konami just said, you know what? Screw you, players. We're gonna we're gonna piss you off. <laughs> Well, that was Boot Camp by Konami in 1987, and it is also known as Combat School. And I think more uh, Boot Camp in the U.S. and Combat School in other parts of the world. But it is Dragonfield meets uh, uh, Marines Training Camp. This is Crazy Clown Radio. Say thanks for watching Boot Camp slash Combat School by Konami 1987. I will catch you later in the future with another video. Have a good weekend, everybody. Bye-bye.